Investigators are trying to piece together what led to a mass shooting in Ohio. Police say a man walked into a Walmart last night in the town of Beaver Creek, just east of Dayton, and shot four people. He then apparently turned the gun on himself. NBC News correspondent Adrian Broaddus joins us now. So, Adrian, I know we just got an update from police in Ohio. What are they saying? That's rising, Clay, and members of law enforcement are still addressing the media, but I will start with the latest information. Investigators have identified that shooter. He is a 20-year-old man who has been identified as Benjamin Charles Jones. Investigators say he was a resident of Dayton, moved away, and then returned to the area about a year ago. As far as the victims, their race or ethnicity has not been identified. The shooter was identified as a white man, but the victims, at least three of them were female, the other was a male, all adults. Now, earlier in the day, we were telling you all that at least three of the victims were listed in critical condition. Their condition has upgraded to stable, but at least one person still remains stable, yet the condition is critical. The motive, that's what many people are wondering. Why did this 20-year-old shooter walk into that Walmart late last night and start firing? It's still unclear. That's a big piece of the investigation. We do know the initial call that came into 911. That person told dispatchers they saw this 20-year-old walk into the store with a gun. We heard from people who were inside shopping at the time. They still are stunned. One woman saying she's lucky to be alive. She recorded the aftermath and shared her account on social media. All of this happening just days before Thanksgiving. We do know, Zin Clay, the four people who were shot were shoppers, not employees of the store, according to investigators. No threat to the community at this hour. The shooter, that 20-year-old, ended his life. Zin Clay? Adrian, just devastating, especially just days before Thanksgiving. I understand that police have also released body camera footage. Can you tell us any information about that? Yeah, within less than 24 hours, we are already getting a look at that body cam video worn by one of the responding officers. On the video, you can hear the officer saying that we got him. During this news conference, it was asked where was this 20-year-old found. According to investigators, the body of the 20-year-old shooter was near the vision area of that Walmart store. As far as the victims, they were found throughout the store and their injuries ranged. Zinclay? Our newest NBC News correspondent, Adrian Broaddus, thank you so much for your coverage and very glad we have you for more reporting here. Thanks for watching. Stay updated about breaking news and top stories on the NBC News app or follow us on social media.